Okay, so in this tutorial we are going to be going over coding. So this is the first coding tutorial. So today we are going to be focusing on the motion block. So as you can see you do the coding in the scripts tab and there are multiple different groups of blocks. So like sound, if I click on there it opens up a new new group of blocks. But today we're only going to be focusing on motion. So what you how to code so you need to um place the blocks on on the canvas on this area here so it's a drag and drop system so if i get this move 10 steps if i click on it hold it down and then just drag it on here then i've placed it on the canvas so to run your programs what you do is you double click on the coding blocks so if i double click here you'd see that the cat moved do that again this time watch the stage okay so as you can see that's what this does so in this tutorial we're going to be going over the move 10 step or the move steps and the turned so many degrees so the move how you can change it so the reason why I didn't say move 10 steps is that you can change it so it's move 15 steps or move 100 steps so if I double click on it now you can see the cat moves a lot more so I, if I want to make, make the cat move backwards I just need to put a negative in it so it's a minus sign like that so if I double click here just did it twice you can see the cat went backwards so the other thing we're going to be doing today is the turn so many degrees. So if I put this here, if I double click on it, see the cat turns. So what's really cool about Scratch is that you could actually put the blocks together. So as you can see when I put it close, you see this white line there. So if I drop this block here, you see they're stacked together. So if I just turn it back, so just going to make it so that the cat is facing this way just double click double click and double click again and then if I double click this you can see that the cat moves back and turns so I just make this positive 20 for now but the cool thing about steps is that they move in the direction the cat is facing so if I click this now if I keep click clicking it you can see the cat's going in some sort of circle because it's turning and then it's moving forwards in that direction so it turns moves forwards turns move forwards turns moves forwards and so on i'll see you in the next video